I need to give an absolute genuine finally on this product right here. When Apple announced HomeKit Secure Video back in June of 2019, I was excited to see all the camera options that would no doubt be dropping soon. Devices like smart security cameras and doorbells like this one that supported HomeKit and recorded privately to your iCloud storage. That all sounded great to me. But then the waiting game began and I kept waiting. 11 months later, Logitech announced the Circle View camera, which I featured in a previous video. It's a smart security camera that ties right into Apple HomeKit, but I still wanted a doorbell and the only one available that supported HomeKit secure video was only available in Europe. That's why I go back to the genuine finally here, because once again, at least here in the US, Logitech is the first to market with a smart doorbell camera that supports Apple HomeKit and HomeKit secure video. What's going on Tech Squad? Andrew Edwards here. And as I mentioned today, we're talking about the Logitech Circle View doorbell. And by the way, big shout out to Logitech for sending over the Circle View doorbell and for sponsoring this video. Now, before we get into the camera itself, a quick overview of what HomeKit Secure Video even is. When you really think about it, your home security footage is one of the most sensitive categories of data captured in your smart home. You only want that footage to be seen by the people you decide to share it with. HomeKit Secure Video is a way to store that footage on Apple's servers with the peace of mind that it won't be seen by anyone else, not even Apple. You see, when the footage is captured, it gets encrypted end to end and is then stored in your iCloud account. Once there, only you and anyone you invite to view it will be able to see it. The most important part here is that the encryption happens on your local HomeKit hub. So that would be your Apple TV, HomePod, HomePod mini, or iPad before being sent to the cloud. And this is why even Apple can't view your files. They're encrypted before they get uploaded. So when using a HomeKit secure video compatible device like the Logitech Circle View doorbell, it'll be able to stream video, send alerts about detected animals, people, vehicles, and store recordings in your iCloud account. But one way or another, you'll need to have an iOS device or a Mac so you can access the camera through Apple's home app and there's no Android support. So again, at a bare minimum, you need either a Mac or an iOS device. Now, onto the Circle View doorbell itself. When looking at the specs, it supports Logitech's TrueView video with a 160 degree field of view, high definition 1200 by 1600 resolution, support for high dynamic range and color night vision. Underneath the camera on front, there's an LED strip that's able to light up an area up to six feet away. You also get two-way audio, allowing you to have a back and forth conversation with anyone standing at your door with acoustic echo cancellation. You can use the two-way audio from your iPhone, iPad, Mac, or Apple Watch, all from the home app on these respective devices. And it should also be said, this is one of the few cameras with two-way talk communication that actually works as expected. So many cameras have this same feature. There's a microphone and speaker on the camera that's supposed to allow you to talk to someone back and forth, and it takes forever to connect when you're on your phone, trying to connect to the doorbell, et cetera. With the Logitech Circle View doorbell, it is almost instant, and the video feed is fantastic as well. Now, face recognition is also included using the People album in your iCloud photo library to identify Yes. The Logitech Circle View doorbell is made with a high quality plastic build with a clean and minimal black design and a glass faceplate on the front. And it has an IP65 water and dust resistance rating. The back of the doorbell has two black pogo pins which snap into one of the two included mounting brackets. There's a straight one or one that's angled at 20 degrees depending on the viewing position that you need. Now I definitely needed the angled mount and appreciated that it was just included in the box. By the way, the Logitech Circle View doorbell does support the same NFC pairing setup process that we've seen recently with AirPods, HomePod, Apple TV, et cetera. If you set any of those things up in the past, you will feel right at home setting this up as well. The hardware setup was pretty easy, but the instructions are in a very frustrating web app and it times out if you take too long, so it requires you to re-answer a lengthy survey 
several times during the process just to get back where you left off. Now, if you've installed doorbells and doorbell times before, that probably won't be an issue for you. But if you're newer, just know that you have to use the online instruction manual. There are no instructions in the box. However, I did ask Logitech about the issue I was experiencing with the survey. And as you can see on screen, they did give me a statement. Basically, they designed it so that you would not encounter the issue that I had. An over aggressive cache clearing on my iPhone may have been the culprit. Now the software setup process is easy. If you set up a HomePod or any other HomeKit device, you'll feel right at home setting up the Circle View doorbell. You're walked through the various options for streaming and recording based on your location, choosing whether you want to enable facial recognition or not, setting up automations, and even the ability to use any number of HomePods and HomePod minis as doorbell chimes. So for example, my home here has three floors, so I can have the chime on the main floor, but also have a doorbell chime sound play from the HomePods on the second floor and the HomePod in the basement, along with the notification that comes to my iPhone. So no matter where I am in the house, or even if someone's house sitting for me, they'll be able to know that someone's at the front door, even if they aren't within earshot of the main doorbell chime. Now, after using the doorbell for about two weeks, I've got to say, it's very easy for my whole family to use and access from their devices. You can view past recordings with the calendar integration at the top of the Logitech doorbell viewer in the home app. And just so you know, with HomeKit Secure Video, you can have one camera set up if you have at least a 200 gigabyte iCloud storage plan or up to five cameras if you have the two terabyte plan or higher. That offers a 10 day recording history that actually doesn't eat up any of your iCloud storage allotment. It's just an extra feature on top. Another cool thing, if you have an Apple TV and you're watching it when your doorbell is pressed, you'll get a notification right on the TV and can view a live feed there as well. Facial recognition will give you an audible announcement from your HomePods if you have the option enabled. Now, as for what's missing, the one thing I wish it did have is package detection. My previous doorbell supplied by my home security company would send me a notification when a package was delivered and would even play a chime if someone else came to my door and a package was waiting there. Unfortunately, HomeKit Secure Video doesn't support this, at least not yet. Luckily for me, I don't have to deal with package thieves here, but it's definitely a feature that I know would give peace of mind to a lot of potential buyers. All in all, I think the Logitech Circle View doorbell is the best option on the market for HomeKit users. You're getting nicely designed hardware, HomeKit secure video, and all the affiliated privacy features that come with it, a better than HD resolution with HDR and night vision, all at a very competitive $199 price tag. If you've been waiting for a compelling HomeKit doorbell experience to upgrade from your non-smart doorbell or even a non-HomeKit smart doorbell, I think the Logitech Circle View doorbell is definitely worth picking up. I am very happy with mine. But now I wanna hear from you. Let me know what you think. Do you already use a smart doorbell? Have you been waiting for a HomeKit compatible doorbell? And if so, is the Circle View doorbell going to be a purchase for you? Let me know in the comments below and I'll meet you there for further discussion. Before I get out of here, big thank you to all of you who've supported my new channel, Hyper Profit. I will leave a link to that down in the description below along with a card here if you wanna tap on it to check it out. That channel is all about my tips and tricks and expertise as it pertains to personal finance. Again, thanks for watching as always, guys. I appreciate your support. I'm Andrew Webers, and I will catch you in the next video.